welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you, well, this video is just going to be, like, all about American Girl. This is, like, a special video because I'm announcing something very exciting, so. I also have two brand new books that I got today, and they're both from American Girl. And right now I'm just showing you my charms <laughs> because I have nothing else to do. And so, yeah, I only have 10 charms, by the way. So let's get started. Yeah. So here's both of the books. Um, I'm going to start with this one. Um, it's... From the American Girl Library, it says a smart girl's guide to friendship, bleh, friendship troubles. And it's got the two girls on the front. So I got this, and um, this book right here was there, but I didn't really want it. So I wanted this one though. And the other one I am super excited about, I got Kaylee. Um, no, I didn't get Kaylee, I got the book. Um, Kaylee. And it's amazing because it's like one of those smaller books. <clears throat> but it's from, um, it's, the line is American Girl Today. It's by Amy Goldman Cost. And this is a really cool. So it says meet Kaylee. And then open the cover. So yeah, it's really cool and I like the art. So. <sighs> yeah. So now I'll be doing a My AD Dolls Room Tour. So here's like an overview of like just the bed. And then her little sisters are in here right now. Her baby sister and then her seven year old sister. Because my AD Doll is nine. And she is the special announcement. So I'm not going to show you her right now. Until the end of the video. So here's just an overview. Um, the blue box is supposed to be in her room. But it kind of disappeared, so I just thought it was there. But it, it's fine. Um, she's got, like, none of this stuff is actual American Girl stuff. All of it is, like, my stuff or homemade stuff. So her little, her seven-year-old sister is the, from one, she's one of the only heart stalls. I customized her by cutting her hair to shoulder length and giving her some white freckles, and I think she is adorable. I love her, and so, yeah, and her baby sister is just this little soft, squishy kind of baby with a hard head, and you can take her head off, but it's still attached, and I don't really want to do that, because I can only use one hand with my camera, and the other hand, and then her little puppy is in a room, and this is her nightstand, it is so adorable, let me move her door, it has the Eiffel Tower, and it's gold, and it's got a pop-up flower, and then this flowers pop out as well, and it's got glitter all over, <coughs> it's actually a stationary box, and then it has this little Pittsburgh, ah, <laughs> oops, it dropped it, and snow globe, and it's the perfect size, Decides it up to her. It's well to her sister. See all the snow? It's actually a actual snow globe. Just a miniature one. And then there's this blue stone. Her room is kind of smurf, minion, and blue themed. So it's really pretty. I love that stone. And then I made this. I made the bowl of clay, and then I, I had already painted it with no polish but then I just painted over it with actual acrylic paint and it kind of white in some places so I kind of need to paint some of this blue aqua color over that but I don't who cares and then I got some of that um stuff that you use for like 
flowers and stuff. And then I got some of these tiny flowers and fruit things and stuck them in there. And it's super adorable. And yeah, I just love it. So I just set it there on my too. And then went to her bed. Her bed is actually the box. But I hot glued it. And so, yeah. And then I just have some fabric that I um, found. And it's the full sheet of fabric. But it's this blue, this aqua blue, white, and gray fabric piece. And then on her bed, she has five slimmers. She has one of these larger ones that can actually stand up, like on hard hard surfaces, of course, and that's on Baker Smith, and he has a little cookie in his hand, which is adorable, and then I have the little Smurfette, which is a smaller one, and she cannot stand up, none of these other four can, but she's super cool, because, like, her hair is really cool, so, that's little Smurfette, and then I have Clumsy, he looks adorable, he looks like a baby, little Smurf baby. And I love these ones because they're like, their legs are so like floppy. And then Papa Smurf back here, his beard is really cool and I like him because he's got red clothes on instead of white, like everyone else. I like Baker too because of his hat, it says Sydney Squishy. And I also like him because of his cookie. And then he's a little grouchy. <laughs> He's so cute because of his little eyes and stuff. I love all of my Smurfs. And then I have a tiny porcelain. Her name is Lydia. After Samantha because my doll was Samantha. But yeah. Because Samantha did have a porcelain doll named Lydia and then she gave it away. But. And then behind my Smurfs. Are these two chalkboards that are clipped onto the string that's all over, and then these two little miniature posters, and then this it says I saw in Jumping Jacks at lunch in a day without electronics. It's really really bad handwriting. <laughs> and then this little card that says Happy Valentine's Day. I I love you forever, Grandma. And then this little card. It says, I love you from Leah, which this girl's name is Larice, and her nickname is Leah, so, um, that was her nickname before, um, the girl of the year came out, so, and then these little roses, which are super cute, and I use another dough of those in this, and then I have these two little gold bird stickers on the corner. That's just super cute behind her bed. And then this trash can, which actually goes on a walker. And just, just got some random stuff in there. Her spoon is actually in there for some reason. And I have this little miniature yarn if you watched my video where I showed you that. And then she's got a whole bunch of random things in there. Of course, she has to have Smurf. And then she has a minion toy back there. And then some random beads. We've got chocolate, um, jelly beans, and then some macaroni and cheese and then she's got three little solo cups and then rubber bands <coughs> pens and markers she's got these two little miniature pens and then three miniature markers there was four but i don't wear the pink one yet and then this little susan two basket from shelkins with a headband two bracelets and a bunch of earrings and another big bracelet. So, yeah. That's about it for her room. She has two, three more toys that her sister is playing with currently. It's this little Pearl little mini critter that is from Finding Dory and Finding Nemo. And then she's also playing with these two minions. Bob and I think that one's Kevin, and then that one's Stuart. So she has some type of figure of all three of the main characters. So I hope you enjoyed this, the main part of this video. 
Now on to the um, final song ones. I probably want to add some here. Notice anything? I got her a new wig. I got her this red curly wig. It is so pretty. I love this wig. Especially this curl right here. Where it goes on the front. Because it's like a perfect curl. She is wearing this adorable dress as well. And yeah. This is a new dress to her. It's not new to me. You can see it on the other dolls. But. Yeah, I didn't glue it on. Yeah, I need to brush it actually. But I, I mean, it came brand new, but I kind of messed it up a little accidentally. But she's gorgeous, and I renamed her. Um, so I don't need any um, help naming her. The name I gave her is May, spelled M E I, and it, her middle name is Margot. So it's or should it? No, I don't think it's gonna be Margot. I don't know her middle name yet, but it's either Margot or Cassie. Or she could have two middle names, so it could be May, Cassie, Margot. Yeah, that's it. It's May, Cassie, Margot, because that sounds the best instead of May, Margot, Cassie. I think. And then her last name is Parkington still. So, yeah. So I kind of like in love with her right now. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time on my channel, which is Heaven 101. Bye!